There is a Korean saying that it always rains on July 7th. There is a reason for this. Would you like to know why? Kyonu and Jingnya. Long ago, the king in heaven had a daughter named Jingnya. She was a kind and beautiful young woman. She was also a skilled weaver. Oh, what wonderful cloth! Jingnya is old enough to be married. On a warm spring day, Jingya came down to earth. She met a young herdsman named Kyonu. They fell in love with each other. I'm so happy to meet you, Jingya. So am I. I want to live happily with you for a long, long time. Kanu and Jingya wanted to get married. The king in heaven heard this news. He became very angry. How can the princess from heaven marry an earthly herdsman? So the king ordered a harsh punishment. Kyonu will stay at the eastern end of the Milky Way. Jingya will live at the western end. They will be separated forever. Kyonu was heartbroken to never see Jingya again. Jingya! I miss you, Kyonu! Kyonu and Jingya cried and cried. Kyonu and Jingya missed each other a lot. They cried so much that their tears fell to earth like rain. Ah, so much rain. Yes, it is. We could have a big flood. A lot of rain fell in the forest. Many birds were living there. I feel so sorry for Kyonu and Jinya. So do I. Let's fly up to the sky and build a bridge for them. Okay. The magpies and crows happily flew up to the sky. The magpies and crows built a bridge across the Milky Way. They used their own bodies for this bridge. <gasps> Jingya, I can't believe that we are together again. <laughs> All thanks to the magpies and the crows. Kyonu and Jingya hugged each other. They shed happy tears. Kanu and Jingya soon had to be separated again. They were sad and cried once more. The magpies and crows felt sorry to see them so sad. They decided that they would build a bridge for them every year on July 7th. Kanu and Jingya always shed many tears each time they parted. So every July 7th, it rains. My friends, can I tell you one more thing? On July 7th, the heads of the magpies and crows lose their feathers. Do you know why? It's because Kyonu and Jingya walk on the birds' heads to meet each other.